your man arrived, uh, Benjamin LeBoss, just the first impression. Yeah, I, I mean, he, he just, uh, we moved him around actually, and I think he looked okay as far as assignments. Um, I'll watch the tape, but he didn't look out of place. How many reps did he get? Probably, I don't know, quarter, maybe the play. So we'll see how it goes. So both him and then we brought an old lineman in as well. We had some uh, some injuries up there, but it's a tough day today. We know we have to get down. We have to lose 10 players. And so we tried to give them as competitive a practice as possible so that they could, you know, showcase their skill and we'll make our decisions. Cameron Jones is who you brought in an offensive line. He played a lot of right tackle before he came here. Do you like the battle developing at the tackle position? For yeah, you? so we, we wanted to bring Cam up right away, um, but he had a, a rookie mini camp. We were staying in touch with him. Uh, there's a few guys that are still in that situation, but we want to validate the work that's been put in here. But we've, uh, we have one of our guys had a shoulder injury right away, and so we do want to keep our numbers up. We're a hair low anyway there uh, with Kyle Saxlid uh, on injured vet, uh, which he's doing better, but he's a ways away. So uh, we felt like the numbers and, and we'll see what Cam can do, but uh, didn't look out of place. And yet it was certainly, um, I guess, a different knowledge base. I could tell some things just didn't make sense, but he's only been here for one day. No Kadeem uh, this year. What's the message to the running backs room? Well, we still got a, a couple vets, uh, all three. We have three of the four that were here last year, and BJ looked excellent in rookie camp, and I've been enjoying what I've watching him. The thing with our running backs have been playing well. Um, really, we, we always commit to the run. We do like backs that um, give us that extra fall forward mode. Um, we do have what both Bellamy and Peyton are kind of the quicker guys, uh, top end speed guys. Mills and Emmons are more shifty, but carry a weight really carries a load behind their pads. So for me as a coach, I like having the kind of the different types of backs and we'll just let it play out. How was the news on Rice and John? Uh, not, I don't think great, but I haven't, I think he's got some imaging today. Um, so yeah, I can't really update you on that except that he was out here for uh, at least uh, locking in mentally and hopefully we'll see him back soon. And then Malin Fant had also got hurt in rookie camp. Do you have to do anything for the Canadian receivers? Uh, uh, yeah, well, you're right. There's a few less numbers there. Um, like the guys, Jalen, I think we'll actually get a full compete practice in, uh, uh, not tomorrow, but the next day. Uh, but yeah, we got to keep looking as well. And uh, you know, feel good about our group. And we actually feel pretty good that we get some racial flexibility too. We want to play two Canadians, but We'll see if we have to. Um, that was part of the, the thinking behind drafting uh, LeBros, see how well he can do. I think that does give us racial flexibility, which is nice.